It's Christmas and you want to give a special gift to your favorite uncle. Your sister just had a baby and you would like that baby to cherish your gift for generations. The average person spends $516 on Christmas gifts alone. Cassandra's Quilted Gifts will meet the market need for one-of-a-kind quilts, pillowcases, and bags. These quilted gifts will be handmade with superior workmanship and materials. Order online to pick the color, style, and size of your gift. The business plan is designed to earn a profit within the first two months of operation. Here's my card. <laughs> okay. My business idea. Cassandra's Quilted Gifts sells personalized homemade quality quilts, bags, and pillowcases for new babies, birthdays, weddings, and memorable occasions. The business will be marketed and sold through the website, social media, and craft fairs. Personalized with few clicks and little time, the customer will be able to select exactly what they want from the website. Gifts will be created and designed by me at my home. Reasons Cassandra's Quilted Gifts will be successful. The website will allow the customer to build their own bag, quilt, and pillowcase by selecting the fabric, style, size, and personalization. This will be a great gift giving alternative because it is personalized and made just for the person. Cassandra's Quilted Gifts will be marketed and sold on my website and marketed through social media. Craft fairs will be also attended locally one-on-one -on -one customer service. I will work with the, each customer to help them end up with exactly what will fit the person who will receive the gift. Quilted gifts are not available in the Pier, South Dakota area, which includes 4,200 families with an average income of $55,292. Through the website, shoppers will be able to order their exact wishes at any time of the day. Well thought out pricing strategy. The quilts will be priced based on the material cost and labor. The fabric will be purchased from fabric wholesalers at no more than $7 per yard. The quilt designs will be interesting and attractive, but will be simple to create. Based on these requirements, a fee of $5 per, per square foot will provide me with a labor fee of $10 per, per hour. If the material cost is greater, the fee will increase accordingly. $781 billion is projected to be spent on gifts at Christmas alone in 2014. I already own all the necessary equipment. My home will be used to produce a s and store the quilted gifts. The website will be created for free through my dad's business. I will use QuickBooks, which my family already owns, to maintain the books. I will be the only person working at the business, so there will be no salaries. I have five years of experience quilting and all the equipment necessary. It takes many years to achieve skill levels to quilt professionally. The possible competitor must have website available, which can be expensive, especially the type for business. It, even if duplicated, my branding of good customer service, quality products, and moderate pricing will win in the end. Drawbacks. Gift shops in the Pier area. My competition will be local gift shops which sell other types of gifts. My other competition will be the quilt and gift shops on the internet. People can purchase these kinds of gift items from large discount stores for less but the quality will be less and the product will not be unique. Startup cost. Um, facility, which is my home and that's free. Um, purchase materials. To start out, I will purchase $200 worth of material that will buy 30 yards of fabric, which is enough for 15 lap quilts. I have this in savings. Advertising, free through Facebook website and through search engines, mass email, through email address collections from the website and craft fairs. Accounting free with QuickBooks. Craft fair registration, $50 to $100. I will attend only local craft fairs, 
so there will be no travel cost. I have this in savings. Labor. I will be the only person creating the gift items. Equipment. I will be the only person creating the gift items. Website. Free, because my dad has a website company. Conclusion. Cassandra's quote the gifts will succeed because customers can build their own gift with a few clicks. Um, the gift buying industry is huge for gifts. No similar personalized quilt gift shops in the Pier, South Dakota area. These gifts are personalized and unique. The gifts are made with the quality workmanship. Thank you for letting me present my business idea. Well done. Great PowerPoint. Yeah, love your PowerPoint. <clears throat> Thanks. How long would it take you to make a queen size quilt? Um, a queen size quilt would, um, let's see, the last one I did, it took like 40 hours. 40 hours? Yeah. And it would sell for about how much? Um, the queen size quilt, it would be like, um, 200 or, well, the lap quilts will be like $50. How and I would, a, how big is a lap quilt? It's, um, a yard by a yard. Yep. So I would usually not do like bigger quilts because those take so much time. So um, yeah, so if they would want me to do a queen size quilt, it would just cost like more because I would just be working on that instead of other products. So uh, if it was a $200 sale and you spent a week on it, that's about <clears throat> five bucks an hour? Um, yeah. Okay. But you'd want to make well, more. Well, I would want to make more, yeah. yeah. I haven't really calculated that. No, I understand. Did you give any thought to if your business is wildly successful, how do you keep up with demand since you're one person? Um. Well, if it would get really, I don't know if it would, because I can like sew so many pillowcases at once, because you can just streamline them, like keep sewing through the sewing machine. So it would. Um, if it would eventually get that big, I would probably have somebody else help me, but <coughs> I don't know if it would get that big. Did you have one you could have brought to show us? Um, I was thinking of it, but I had a lot of pictures of them on there. Yeah, yeah. So like um, That would be good. That would really Yep. Yeah. Or if you ever do this again. Yeah. Your your PowerPoint or your it's really good. This isn't a PowerPoint, it's a yeah, it is. Yes. Yeah, it's PowerPoint. And uh, that was really good. And if you had the actual visual that we could see, that actual would have product. just been... Especially when it's a handmade product like you're making. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. And it's about your quality of workmanship. That would have been... Uh, that would be a nice touch. Yep. Even if it was just a pillowcase, something small you could bring along. Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Something to think about. Mm -hmm. And the gift of yeah. a lap quilt. For I was sure. just going to say, and if yeah, we're, exactly. we're judging <laughs> next year, all the judges would love a lap quilt. Yeah, take, just get one for you. Brown. If you give me my card, I'll come to your website and I'll put in an order. How's yeah. that? <laughs> yeah. How long have you been sewing? Um, for five years. Yeah. Well, you must enjoy it. Yeah, yeah, I like sewing. Do you have a fabric store in Pierre that you can even get it? From? Yeah, there's okay. fabric stores, but I would probably get it off the online stores because those are more like they're cheaper. Do you think you're going to actually do this? Probably, if I have time, because yeah, it's you don't have this website yet. That was no, just your yeah, I okay. but I want to. Yeah, if my dad will help me. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Quill. There you go. Thank, Thank you. you. Yep. Good job. Good job.